Yo, it's me Takir for another video on Senna. I'm currently playing on my Smurf, so it's average master hero. I'm facing Milo, which is a really easy matchup. Even if Ash is a bit scary in the early, so I, sh I don't know. I could trade Milo really hard, but I have to be careful that Ash doesn't slow me too much. Uh, and Xayah is not really a champion without her E. Ah oh, fuck, he accused the world like an idiot. Like, Milio doesn't do damage, he just gets money when he trade me. But me, I can get a soul. Do you want to W, I guess? Yes, yeah, the slow uh, fuck me a lot. Nice shield. Okay, Milo use everything. I just don't want to fight them when they have W of Milio. Okay, she kinda fucked up. They have Mastery Jungle, we don't really want to give kill to Mastery. Ah, uh, she's... She's faster with Milio shield. Okay, Master is topside. We are fine then. We can pressure them still. She's gonna have to eat the CS. Yeah, it was a bad trade because Ash is such a better champion in early. Ash is still have Ghost. Ah, I don't have the range. I was thinking I had the range to auto and kill her because Milio was, was not in range to shield her. Oh, that was so cringe. I mean, Milio got the two kill. My, actually, my first time losing against Milio in lane. But yeah, Ash is such, such a broken champion. And like, they uh, let Ash stack little tempo for free and she kinda get fucked. Yeah, shit happen. Just have to play more safe, I guess, even against Emilio. I mean, I always kill him, but... Why did she not ward? She even have a ward. It's so Mastery. Oh, he already got a kill. And Mastery get feed, Emilio can just peel him and it's Normally I destroy Milio in lane. That's why I, I don't really understand how he loses. Why did she not Q? Ok, 
to go on Mirio then. I mean, Ash inted, yeah. My story should be there. I mean, if she stays, not my problem. I'm gonna take swiftness. I don't know why she pushed on the other way. If Mastery was there, she would have died. Lucky her. Lucky her. Uh, Mastery stop. Might be in the jungle. Still. Can we check? Okay. Okay. But yeah, I, I didn't really understand when Kyo and I didn't use our Q instantly to like stun her because I from a W so that when she gets stunned she will get root after it and she was fucked but she waited. I don't know how, why. But I guess, I mean we still kill Milio at the end but I think we, we would have get a double kill out of uh, this move. Emilio is mid. Subdiff OMG. I mean, she's misposing so much, but we cannot do anything about it. We can go direct now. We have prior, but I mean, they have to move. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna let Xayah alone, but... Okay, z the dry call is fine, I guess, if Xayah come. Okay, we get Drake. Where is Master? I guess he's top again. He's getting free kill top. Why would he not go top? Also, Herald is up. Yeah. Why is she chilling? They have double six. Ash might try to hold me because I'm an easy target. I don't have my old. I have my old. But, uh, it's kinda strange, Emilio tries so hard to take vision, but. And now it's gonna do it, that's why Emilio warded. And they hard force it, so I know. They could have just. I played slowly and they might have baited me. The thing is, it's so obvious when the bot lane is going full aggro at some point, when they are playing passive the whole laning phase. It doesn't make sense. Uh, I don't know if she's dead. I mean, she should hold. I mean, we lose so many old. The master is chilling, but he might try to dive us. Guy, you have ult, so he might be able to ult us. Just have to make sure the way doesn't crash. Ah, but.
I think it was even too late to leave the turret. It just like Ash made or destroy us in 2v2. So we could not do anything about the wave. And Galio was doing shit mid, so... Hopefully she kill her. Okay, rip my ult. What? Nah, but Milo is cringe. Huh? Okay, he's allowed to be cringe. Like my dream to have a jungle that feed. I think he's gonna do the same now. I mean, they don't. They won't be able to crash it now. He just auto the turret like an idiot, but. Yeah, they do the same again and again. It's not like my team gonna do anything about it. Ah, such a shitty game. I just can't fucking play in this. I guess I should not have fucked up in early, but it will not change the fact that Master is just gonna one shot me. I mean, it's mostly because my fucking top lane are giving 10 kills to Mastery. And Kuyana is just chilling. Lucky you are here because you were dead. It's still playable if mastery ends. Like only bot lane. On, I mean bot lane is not that fit, but it's gonna be a problem. And if we one shot mastery, we should be able to win. And I can outscale Milio and be more useful. Even if early was shit. I can still come back, I'm Senna. But yeah, uh, Ash gonna be really scary, like she have a lot of assist and shit, and I think she got a pretty nice amount of plate. Ah, but I'm not gonna hold there. I don't have an ult. Yeah, I don't need my ult. I'm just gonna keep it for bot lane. I don't have a Mrod Lev anyway. Why does she push the wave? They can just freeze us then. I don't have my flash if she arrow me. They don't freeze us. Strange. Uh, I mean, Mastery is top now. He's losing. I mean,. I could have hold. I think he can 1v2 them. Like he have Dust Blade and Akali is nothing. But it's 2v2 bot, but we lose 2v2. Not if they play like this. Oh, she still has the ult. Uh, I mean, she used it before. But it cannot surprise me. Still managed to survive this shit. I heal more than Milio heal. I think Mastery was topside still. I mean, my team is winning. <laughs> Even if shit is happening in bot lane. The fact that we don't die is good. And I think Ash use everything on my ass, so. Let's say it's worse, even if I have to use everything to survive. Oh my god, that was close. It's kind of the fun part is like Jay is getting ganked by the enemy spam gank. 
even kill to mastery but still manage to carry the game. He's the one making the game hard and he's also the one that's gonna win. But we didn't need him to actually the flip thing like that. I mean we kinda need in bot lane <laughs> for some reason. I don't know if it's me that like to I did bad trade for sure but I feel like my ADC is not doing the damage he should be putting on. Can you stun her? Why, why is she never stun them? At this time I'm not gonna miss my flash. Once was too much. I mean what happened in, in early game is so cringe. Can master be bad? Oh no, he stop. I mean, they have Bounty, we are so ahead now. But, like, the thing is, what Kiana did, I don't know why she didn't do it earlier, like. Why does she stay? Why does she greed? Rumble is bot. Shut down. She actually give a shot down to the enemy team. Not that worse. Huh? Let's go. Why everyone is ping self being like, oh, I'm so good, guys. Oh, look. I'm the best player alive. Woohoo. I'm rank 1 Senna. Look, I'm platinum. <coughs> At least we're gonna win this shit. I don't know, I feel like Melee is such a useless champion. That's maybe it's just because Senna just destroy him. Like the matchup is easy for me, so that's maybe why I just think the champion is useless. But I mean he's still better than Lulu. And a lot of other champions. But yeah, who care about the meta if you are good with a champion you can Still do shit like Milius still managed to beat my ass. Okay, we can maybe do something with Akali. That's not Akali. Oh, Akali is behind us. <laughs> Rumble, what the fuck is it doing? But just walking. I mean, yeah, we, we, he hinted top. That's maybe why. Like, we. How to say this? Like, the enemy jungle fucked us. We fucked up bot. But even if we lose bot, we didn't lose as much as top lane, no? That's why it's, it's fine. Like, we just have to play safe, scale. And wait, and hopefully you will win. You will not win every game, ob obviously, because there is just. I mean, if you fucked your lane, you should not win. But in some cases like that, where enemy are just hinting way more, like mid laner and top laner, why would I fucking flip anything? But when you are losing, 
Just wait for them to carry me and it's GG. You have to let you have to understand that you have to let yourself being carried by your mate your teammate if they can. That's how you're gonna win way more LP. Even if you're bad, it's not a problem, you just have to play safe. That's why I think playing safe is the best option for solo queue. I mean, for Senna at least. For scaling champion. Because you will always be stronger than. Okay, Mastery still managed to survive this. Everything is fighting. Look, we are not invisible because of the turret. Yoohoo! For such an easy game, lol. Where is GG? Well, that was all for the game. Hope you like it. Leave us a review. Yeah.